Good morning viewers. We're at Werribee Boat Ramp this morning. We're going to, I think this is Port Phillip Bay Fishing Adventures Part 4. And today we've got a special guest. I'm here. Thomas Dobrin. How are you going Thomas? Good, yourself? Yeah, not bad. So, um, you've been fishing with Marinka before, yeah? Yep. So, what do you think we'll catch today? Fish, calamari. Calamari, some snapper, maybe yeah. some whiting. Yeah, so you're excited? I'm, I'm very excited. You know this is going on YouTube. Yeah. So all your friends will see. <laughs> Say hello to all your friends. Hello everyone I know <laughs> if they're watching this. Yeah. Anyway, we'll see you on the water. And there's Anthony. Go okay, Anthony. What are we An Anthony's a, the uh, master fisherman. Yeah, absolutely. I, I think the best chance of what we got to get to catch today is toilet paper in the Werribee River. Yeah. And look how calm it is. So we should get something today, Anthony. What do you reckon? Maybe a gummy, maybe a gummy shark, some flathead, some calamari. Oh, well, this is a boat. 115 horsepower mariner. Goes along all right. You ready, Captain? Are. Captain Ahab. Yep. Here we are. Another, fish. another day, another fish. Yeah. Thirty seconds, and Anthony, Anthony's already got a calamari. Would you believe that? Thirty seconds. Well, you've got it on film, so it's true. Yeah, but the film doesn't show it was thirty seconds. Look, look at this. The jig's bigger than the actual squid. That's a good jig. Yeah, because maybe there's a follower. Marinko's got a calamari. Is there anything following him? Got a jig run underneath. If he shoots out his water, then he's not going to be as heavy. Come on, shoot it out. Oh! I'll have to just lift him up. There we go, calamari. Oh! Oh, that's a big one. That's our catch, and that's our lunch. <laughs> Marinko's made a mess of his sandwich. <laughs> what are you eating, Thomas? My food. Anthony's too busy to eat. Yeah, way too busy. Are these? Yeah. Look at Zero squid. Lift him up. It's not often we get aero squid, we always get calamari. Get him right in the face. Oh. They're aggressive and the ink's different. Look, look, catch, we caught a conjovi, look at that. It's conjovi, it's like a pink flesh in there when you squeeze it. See that? It's got like the pink, it's got bait inside. That's like a. Oh. <laughs> See that? You know what that is? That's like a buffet to fish. <laughs> See that? It's got like oh, a yeah. what, what the hell? It's good bait. 
you reckon? Yeah, it's really good bait. This this stuff here, see? Kanjobi. Yeah. Can yeah. you eat it? Is it edible? Yeah, if you want to die. <laughs> see that? For the whiting. So that's it. There's a lesson you learnt. You've been fishing the bait 40 years. that shell there, that looks like a um, scallop shell, the one on there. It's a good one too. Bring him to the top and I'll grab This is, this is where you lose. I've got the thing on. 99% oh. of fish are lost on top of the water. Come on man, just bring him to the top, what are you waiting for? This way. Make him swim this way. Ooh. Get him on the boat! <laughs> He's a good gunny. Ow, ow, ow! Okay. Oh, he's, he's gone easily off the size. scale. Yeah, he's gone off the scale. <laughs> it's good enough. He's not. He's not huge, but definitely a good eating one. Probably get one a bit bigger, you know. So that's something. flake, yeah, Anthony. This is the best gummy gummy flake you can actually get. So the ones in the fish and chip shop, that's what they sell. So apparently it's the best tasting <laughs> flake as well. Yeah, and yep. it's fresh, straight from Port Phillip Bay. Yeah. Too bad I didn't bring my barbecue. Oh, if you brought barbecue, your barbecue, no, I reckon we'll um. No, pan fried or something. No, no, we could have we could have pan fried it on my little stove. Probably, maybe all those. Anyway, maybe all those. Fish. Pretty big, it's pretty big. Now bring him up, bring him up. See so Anthony, the two things I told you to do. Hey anyway. Anthony, oh. the two things I told you to do a squid head and a soft plastic, and you get the two biggest fish. Oh, oh let's hey, move. What do you mean move? No, that's it. What do you reckon? Well, we've got 400. If we get 436 dollars, oh, I'll throw that back. That's that's, <laughs> the, big, that's the biggest one today. Oh, come on. Shit. Oh, he just broke off now. He just came out. <laughs> that was lucky, man. Alright, we're in one metre of water off Point Cook. Look at the snapper we got. What was that? Can you repeat that? <laughs> we're in one metre of water off Point Cook on a flathead fillet and a snapper just took it. That's amazing. Hold that fish up, Anthony. Look, Look at that. Beautiful. Not bad. Just to add to our tally. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh. Oh, mine's probably not even. Let me get it out. Inexperienced net, are you know? No. Okay. All right. Two. Another big one. There's a bird up there. Eddie will be happy. Fast. There you go. We finished our fishing trip. And we're about to head back to the boat ramp. So, Anthony, we had a good day, yeah? Yeah, absolutely. We, so, um, how many dinkies do you reckon there are? 
More than 20, yeah? Pretty close. Yeah, yeah. Pretty close. We got quite, we probably got close to 15 platted, I reckon. Yeah, and some squid and some calamari. Some calamari about, yeah. Yeah. So this is the catch. There's a big one there. So, Marinko's cleaning up the boat. That's it. So, we're... Thomas, you were the cameraman today. Well done. What have you got to say for yourself? Good catch. Good catch. Good catch yeah. today. Looking Bad forward. Girl. Looking forward to getting home. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, we're heading back, and I'll do some filming when we get to the boat ramp. All right.